Hi guys, welcome back to another episode of Growing Together. So right now, Natalie is just going on a reflective walk around the neighborhood. Oh no. Oliver's in the back carrier, but it seems that the carrier has disappeared. So he is just floating. You know. He's also really upset. I don't know why. Oh, it's back. Yay. So today is finally going to be the day that we go to Mount Kamarebi. I'm really, really excited. I've been waiting for this day for a long time. They're finally going to get to go visit where Natalie grew up. They're going to meet her childhood best friend. And it's just going to be a lot of fun. You've also probably already noticed that my game looks a little bit different. I switched up the G-Shade that I was using a little bit, just like messing with settings and stuff. I felt like the other preset was just like a lot. It was very like intense and honestly it was kind of hurting my eyes to look at for a long time. And for some reason I'm just kind of feeling the more vanilla look to the game. Which I never thought I'd say. I've been a very intense preset girly for a long time, but I'm starting to appreciate, like, I don't know, how the game looks. I still think that the game without any, any reshade or g-shade is, like, horrible, so I won't be going that far, but this one is definitely a lot less intense. So it looks like Amelia is home from school. She is feeling so bad about this loose tooth, so I honestly think that we should try to pull it out, which gives me the absolute heebie-jeebies, but I feel like she would be the type to do that. And she's taking out the trash, wow. How responsible of her. If I was a child, you could never catch me taking out the trash on my own free will. Alright, Natalie's back home. Oh no! I have a repair service for that because I cannot be bothered. She's feeling really flirty. Smooth sailing from milestone reflection during a walk. Natalie's love life has been pretty drama free. No breakups, no cheating. Maybe she should write a book to help others be as successful in romance? What? <laughs> That's really cute. Alright, Elisha's back from work. He's dazed. Mental fog from starting to burn out. Elijah's starting to feel woozy from his mental load. Maybe he should take a break or exercise some creative skills before it gets worse. Well, lucky for you, we are going on vacation. I think that we will just go ahead and go. Um, I guess we'll wait for the guy to come fix the sink. And I actually do want Oliver to shave his facial hair because I've had enough of the mustache, I can't lie. <gasps> what is he doing over here? Natalie. Natalie. You did not leave him. It's raining. Why are my sims like this, man? They're either like obsessed with the infants and won't stop picking them up, or they just leave them and act like they don't exist. I think it's time... We can wiggle her tooth or pull it out. Let's just go ahead and pull it out. Oh! Oh my god! Amelia lost her loose tooth. She can't wait. She can wait for a while for a new tooth to appear. Or can elect to fix missing tooth? What does that mean? Tooth yoinked. It was loose, but Amelia feels a bit bereft of their insecure incisor. What? Okay. She's going to go read under her covers. Do we have the tooth? Like, where did it go? I could have sworn there was like a tooth fairy or something. Is that not a thing? Fix missing tooth? What does that even mean? Will she like go to the dentist? <laughs> oh no. Oh! <gasps> she did not pick up baby! Can I just teleport him? I'm teleporting him. Okay, there we go. Because literally, what? Let's change his diaper. 
and give him a bath. Oh my, I cannot believe she just left him there. I told her multiple times to go get him and she did not care. She is too focused on her love life. <laughs> I mean, I guess it's great that she's feeling good about their relationship. I guess it is perfect timing that we're leaving. Because Oliver is feeling very stressed out about work. Oh my god, there's a demon on our doorstep. I think this is one of Amelia's friends. Hi friend, are you having a good day? Yes, Atlas. That's so cute. But I think, yeah, she made friends with him. So I think I'm just gonna head into cast really quick and fix him. Because I feel bad. Okay, I went ahead and fixed him. So I'm gonna have her invite him in. And just talk to him a little bit. Oh, she feels so bad about her tooth. I want to see if it's actually missing. Wait, smile. Oh my gosh! That is so cute, actually. She looks so cute. Okay, thankfully Elijah's taking care of baby because he is not doing good at all. And then let's feed him and just put him to bed. I'm gonna have Natalie go introduce herself to um, Curtis here. Dude, honestly, he reminds me of... Oh my god, who is it? It's like the kid from the Lorax. Okay, well, it's raining, so do you guys want to like go inside? Like, hello? Let's go chat here. And I guess we'll have them watch a little movie. Let's have them watch Super Kids. Oh my god, why is she sobbing? What? I'm s Uh... What the F, man? Okay, go ahead and put the baby to bed. I can't wait to age him up into a toddler, honestly. He has been an infant for so long. At least it feels like it. I don't know. Where did her friend go? What? He literally ditched us. Okay. Oh no, we don't have any food. How about you just go make a quick meal? They are so flirty. Oh, they're so cute. Oh my god, why does that look so good? Teach valuable lesson. I love how he's eating cake and she's eating a cup of noodles for dinner. Can we talk about her tooth? Raise effort and creativity growth. Oh, it raised her confidence. I believe in me. Amelia feels like anything is possible when that special sim who believes in her is nearby. Stop, that's so sweet. They're all just eating cake for dinner, like, oh my god. They're heading off to bed. Alright, I have a feeling the rest of the night is going to be pretty uneventful, so I think I'll just meet you guys in the morning when they're getting ready to go on their trip. Alright you guys, it is super early in the morning. It is like 5 a.m. And they have their suitcases all packed. And they are ready to go on their flight. Natalie is just making some coffee right now. And Amelia is taking a shower. Getting baby all ready. He is feeling so good this morning. Let's just cuddle him a little bit. Alright, I'm gonna let them drink their coffee. And I guess we'll need to pack this. I don't think we'll need the crib or anything, but I'll bring these as well. All right, well, I guess I'll have them grab their suitcases and they can be heading out. All right, you guys, they have landed in Mount Kamurabi and it is so snowy outside. Oh, don't set that baby on the snow. Amelia! She will not be stopped. Oh my lord. Let's, um... Tell not to make a mess. Oh, so sweet. Oh my gosh, he got his first vacation milestone. Vacation mode on. Oliver is excited for his first vacation with the family. All the time to relax and have fun. What could be better? Is he really thinking all that? Like, okay, I don't think she even scolded her, but 
let's just stop doing that. So the place that they are staying is insane. I did not realize how dramatic it was, but it's really cute, you know? They have their own hot springs. It's definitely a lot, but it's really, really pretty and, you know, it's for their wedding, so I think we should go all out. Even though I did have to cheat for money, you know, it's no big deal. Oh, please stop. Pick him up, please. Wait. Oh, he sat up! Sit up, milestone unlocked. Yay! Oh, that's so sweet. Oh, he took a picture. Stop it. Okay, well, I think that we should be... Oh, what the hell? Yamajan? Like, <laughs> what? Okay, as I was saying, I think that we should head over to her parents' house so we can finally go see where Amelia grew up. I mean, Natalie. Oops. Alright, we made it to her parents' house. And Oliver got the first visit to family member unlocked. Oliver visited a family member for the first time. Uh, did you? And Kennedy and Charlotte are actually here as well. They are vacationing for the wedding, so let's go knock on the door. Oh, her mom's coming out to greet them. Whoa, where are you going? I guess she wants to order some food, so let's just get some onigiri. Oh my gosh, she's coming over too. They all want to order food. Yeah, so this is her parents' house. It's really small and cute, so let's just go have Oliver, I mean, Elijah, oh my gosh, I keep mixing up all of their names. He's gonna go say hi to Yoko. Thank you so much for having us. I'm gonna show some baby pictures of Oliver. Oh, what? And just chat a little bit. I swear, she left the baby again. I'm just gonna keep teleporting him, I can't be bothered. Gosh, she is just helping herself. I'm gonna have Amelia go talk to Charlotte. So is Elijah as well. Oh, Natalie, why are you just running all over? Oh my god. Stop it. That is so cute. He's just sleeping on the floor. They are so cute. Oh. oh my gosh, Amelia and Kennedy have such a good relationship. Let's go have them talk a little bit. I don't know where Natalie's dad is. I don't see him. Oh, there he is. Let's go say hi. I think I'm gonna actually have them go to a community lot here just so they can hang out a little bit. Okay, I had them go to the park and Oliver got his first trip to park milestone unlocked. That's so sweet. But he is not feeling too good, honestly. I think we should have left him home. But I'm gonna have Natalie invite over somebody that we have not met yet. Wait, is she already here? Where is she? Oh my god! We didn't even invite her and she's here! So this is Sara Fukada. It is Natalie's childhood best friend. And we have not seen her in so long, so I am so excited that she just showed up. Let's introduce her to Oliver. Yeah, she is just so pretty. I love her so much. And I think that she's going to be our maid of honor in our wedding. Oh my gosh, she's trying to learn to ride her bike. Okay, listen, I don't know how you got the bike all the way from uh, San Sequoia to Macamari, but I'm not going to ask questions. Let's go introduce her to Oliver. Here is our baby. Oh my god, literally stop. This is adorable. Oh, so cute. Do you love your auntie? Oh. He's feeling very upset though, so I think we're gonna have to take him back and um let's feed him. Oh no, she disappeared. Okay, let's feed baby, and then I'm just gonna put him in the back carrier. So he can hopefully fall asleep. Oh my gosh, is he trying to teach her how to ride a bike? Atlas, do you want to play again soon? Yes! When we are back home, 
Oh. Oh my god, stop. This is so adorable. I'm gonna have Natalie go hug Elijah. I think that this is the first time they've been in Mount Karebi since they got engaged and had kids. So it's just really sweet that they're finally back here and they have a family. Let's go talk to Sara a little bit. Oh my gosh. And it looks like Elijah hasn't even met her, which I think they definitely have met before, but maybe it's been a few years. So let's just have them talk a little bit. Oh no, little Charlotte is stinky. Is no one going to change her diaper? How about you go do it, Elijah? Because where is her mother? Like, hello? Nowhere to be found. I can't believe she's learning to ride her bike in Mount Kamurabi. It's so sweet. I forgot how pretty it is here. Like, this is so cute. I'd honestly love to have them move here, but, you know, we are in San Sequoia, so I don't know. Maybe in the far, far future we will do that. I'm gonna have Amelia go play on this jungle gym. Everyone is just hanging out. I love it. Oh no! Why are you putting him on the floor, man? All you have to do is hold him in the back carrier. Like, what is so hard? Poor baby is so upset! She's so cute with her little missing tooth. I love it. Learning from mistakes from losing confidence. The best way to learn is through mistakes. Next time Amelia is going to succeed. What a great lesson in growth mindset. Wow. This girl is so confident. I love it. I'm gonna have them take a photo together because it's been such a long time. Oh my gosh, wait, there's another kid here. What's his name? Uh, hello. Oh yeah, Taku Akiyama. Let's go introduce ourselves. Are you guys gonna take a photo? Go take a photo, please. Oh my gosh, and Nanami's here too. She's just meeting all of the neighborhood kids. Okay, they're finally taking it. Oh my god, they're so adorable. Oh my god, stop! Oh, I love that she's making friends. Talk about sibling. Oh, this is so cute! They're all just hanging out. Tell a goofy story. No, he's leaving. Oh! Oh my god! Alright, I think we're gonna head back to her parents' house to have dinner. And just hang out a bit. Alright, they're back at her parents' house and they're just having some hot pot for dinner. Oh my gosh, poor baby is not having a good time at all. And he finally has the fun bar, so he's starting to get, you know, more upset if he's not having fun. So what can we do to have fun with him? I guess just play peekaboo. Oh my gosh, this cat is always chasing its tail. Okay, let's change his diaper. And then I think we need to be heading back to the house, the rental, because their needs are not doing very well. Oh my gosh, Amelia, eat some food. Okay, yeah, their needs are not very good right now. They've had a very long day, so... Let's just have them go back. Alright, they've made it back to the rental house and their needs are so bad, so I'm just gonna have them head to bed. I did want to age um, Oliver up, but I think we're gonna have to do that tomorrow because they are just not feeling well at all. So yeah, I will meet you guys in the morning. Okay, it is now morning, and Oliver woke them up by crying. Baby is so hungry, he's not having a good time at all. So I'm just gonna have her breastfeed him, and then what can we do to make him have some fun? Let's bounce and play peekaboo. Oh my gosh, is he going to light the fire? Wow, so cozy. 
Serve some breakfast. Let's do some French toast. All right, I'm gonna have Amelia wake up as well. And let's go grab some French toast. I am so like ready to eat them up because infants are just so much work. Honestly, I might just buy a cake and literally age him up right now. Alright, yeah, I'm just gonna have Elijah go bake a cake for him. Let's just make... Oh my gosh, the famous birthday cake. Is that from The Sims 3? No, don't make a mess, please. Does she not have, like, any toys? Is that why she's so bored? I thought there was toys up here. Yeah, go play dolls. Then I'm gonna have Natalie go take a shower. Oh my god, that is so cute. Let's go wake up Oliver. Okay, go pick him up. Okay, I actually... Oh, we can't help him blow out the candles. Okay, that's great. Oh no, is she gonna miss this? Oh, so cute. Blow it out, baby. Oh my gosh. Wait, let me look at what his traits are right now, just so I can make a good decision. He's cautious, frequently sneezes, free air tinkler, loves wake up time. Sadly, we did not get him to crawl, but I honestly think that's the only thing that we didn't do. So... Oh, wait! Okay. Randomize? Angelic. I mean, it randomized to Angelic, so I'm gonna keep it. I forgot that they, the toddler traits aren't that in depth. Oh, little baby. All right, I think I'm gonna give him a little makeover real quick. All right, I went ahead and gave him a little makeover, and he is so adorable. He is very upset right now, though, because he's super tired and is not having a good time. But, you know, he's so cute. And he did actually age up with brown eyes, so I just went ahead and kept them. All right, well, I've been recording for almost an hour, so I think I need to wrap up the episode here. I'm so happy that he is now a toddler and... I can't wait for them to get married in the next episode and have the kids and family be a part of it. So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching this episode and I will see you all in the next one. Bye everyone!